Today we're talking about Simon, who personally for me, he's, he's one of our VIPs of all time. Love Simon and his transformation is one that just can't help but put a smile on your face. It became pretty obvious that I really needed some um, serious dental treatment. From the moment Simon walked in, one thing was obviously lacking and that was just his general overall confidence. And it's something that with his personality and he's just the most lovable guy of all time. It's a confidence thing, it's a look thing. I don't really smile, I got some missing front teeth, you know, it's not something I'm, I, I don't have the confidence to, to go out. It's a shame at the time that he didn't have the confidence that he should have because he's great and everybody loves him and he, he just, you know, he's just waiting to really kind of come out and blossom and so I hope you guys get to appreciate the, the change in Simon 1 and Simon 2. The thing that, that I was really looking for, you know, is it, the confidence to get, to get my smile back and, uh, and, and take it from there. We're here to help. We can subspecialize in all sorts of different things here because we've got eight docs that all do a little bit of different dentistry. We all focus on what we're best at, what we're most passionate about. And with our, our teams combined, we can do a ton. So for instance, for Simon, he'd see me, then he'd see Dr. Creaseman for a little while, then he'd come back to me and he'd go back to Creaseman. And that's because we were doing different phases with different skill sets and doing what Simon needed. When Simon got to me, the surgery part had already been completed. We had already started the process of getting the, the implants and everything in place. My job was to actually make sure that the finished product worked in terms of the bite as well as the aesthetics because it's not just about whether or not you can chew on them. We want it to look good too. I, I'm not looking for a Hollywood smile. I just really want to, you know, just something that doesn't stand out as being being odd. You know, I just want it, it's the confidence of going out and not having to subconsciously, you're always thinking, yeah, I don't really want to go there. I don't really want to speak there. I'll try and avoid that. So I, you, you can't keep doing that. So so I want to get the confidence so I, so I don't have to worry about that. In many offices, you have to go see one doctor and they do something and then you wait on a report and they send it back and forth. Here, we all sit in the same room, we all talk to the patient, we all understand their goals, and it's really a effort that we can all sit and, and have one big brain looking at everything and getting the best results that way. And watching his personality come out is just so fun, and now he's just the life of the party. Every time he's here, there everybody stops in the room because they everybody wants to hang out with Simon because he's so fun and funny. Yeah, so what I think the first uh, uh, feeling I got once I, I saw the smile was that um, I felt a lot more confident. I felt a lot more comfortable. I even, you know, not just uh, when you talk to people, but it's when you're out and about. That uh, little bit of nervousness of not wanting to go out because I had an issue with teeth and they didn't look good, that went away. And it's just such a great feeling not to to have that worry anymore. So the reaction from my family and friends is, uh, is a little interesting because um, um, I'm obviously an English guy here in the US, and, and I haven't been to the UK for, for two years now, so I haven't seen anybody. But that being said, um, you know, I talk a lot on uh, um, Zoom, Skype, or whatever, and, and they've all been amazed. I mean, they 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 just couldn't couldn't believe it. And, and even my friends uh, locally, the ones that I that I have seen, I mean, they are uh, uh, speechless. I bet you're glad you did it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you just wish you'd done it sooner. Yeah. Well, hindsight's a great thing. Yeah.